A day in the life of Loki begins with laying on your back and having your stomach scratched. He sleeps with my husband and I every night and this is pretty much a typical morning waking up with Loki. Then he's up and ready for breakfast, headed downstairs. Let him out. Let him in. And he always waits before you tell him he can eat. And he'll stand there and wait until you say, okay. And he plays with his ball while we eat our breakfast and watch TV. Tennis balls are his favorite toy. Then it's time for school, so he lays under my youngest daughter's desk pretty much every day until school is over, and then school's out and it's party time! into the daily life of Loki. It's funny because he's always the kind of dog we need him to be at a certain moment. So in the morning, he's like relaxed. He doesn't wake you up early wanting to go out. He'll sleep in as long as you want to sleep in. And then we get up and he has breakfast and he plays around in the living room until we get done with breakfast. He hangs out in the homeschool room with us like he has always done since he was a tiny puppy. And he just, fits in so well with the family and he means something different to everybody in the family. He brings something different to everybody in the family. For me, he's like my little buddy. He sticks with me pretty much all the time. No matter what I'm doing, he is always right by my side. He helps me at nighttime when I'm having trouble sleeping and I had been suffering with some anxiety issues and having him in the bed with me. My husband's there too, but you know, he goes to sleep and it kind of makes you feel like you're alone. and. Even though, even if Loki's asleep, um, it's just, it's comforting to have him in the bed with us and I'll pet him and it's just relaxing and it really helps me so much at nighttime especially. So I really feel a deep bond and connection with him, if nothing else, but for that reason, because he has helped me with so many of the health issues that I had been having this year. For our girls, he really is like another sibling. Like I said, he goes to school with us. Since we homeschool, he stays in the homeschool room. He insists on laying under my youngest daughter's desk which you saw in the video, which is funny because, you know, when he first started sleeping there, he was a small puppy and he could very easily fit in the very tiny spot under her desk. But as he's gotten bigger and bigger and bigger, and now he's 83 pounds and he still insists that he's a puppy and can sleep under her desk. He just keeps on coming out farther and farther wrapped around the chairs, the legs of her chair and everything, but he doesn't care. He likes to stay there. It's his little safe place to stay while we homeschool. They like to dress him up. They do all kinds of games with him outside. They have such a good time with him and he has brought so much joy into their lives. And for my husband, I think he's just truly man's best friend. I mean, he's the only other man in the house besides my husband, so they kind of have to stick together. But they have a little thing they do. Every night, Loki comes and sits in front of my husband on the couch and expects my husband to scratch his nose. And he only likes it when my husband scratches his nose. So that's kind of something they do together and they have a really close bond as well. He has added so much joy and happiness to our lives just in the last year that we've had him. He's an incredible dog. He's really well behaved. He's friendly. And I just, I can't say enough good things about him. I love him to pieces and he's been such a great addition to our family. In this video, I have paired up with Pets Add Life to help them in their campaign to get the awareness out there of how incredible our pets really are and how much joy and happiness and enrichment they bring us in our lives. And whether you have a pet or not, or you're thinking about getting one, I just think pets are amazing. And I think you underestimate how much happiness they can really bring you until you have one. And then you really realize what you've been missing all that time. It's so much more enjoyable to come home to a house that has an animal in it. And I think it makes all the difference in the world. I've, I've grown up with dogs. So dogs are my favorite domesticated animal. And I think, for us, having a golden retriever, it's the perfect personality that our family needs. He can be crazy with the kids, he can be calm with my husband and I, and he is just an amazing dog. So I hope you enjoyed this video and getting to see a little glimpse into the daily life of Loki. Check out the Pets Add Life YouTube channel. I've got a link in the description box below. There's all different kinds of videos on their channel that you probably enjoy watching as well, and I will see you in the next video. Bye.